a time, in a seventh grade math class, two young girls were seated next to one another. Take a walk in the park. As fate would have it, we ended up becoming the best of friends and grew to be like a sister to one another. Over the years, the girls grew closer, even though the distance between them grew further. They matured into young women and carved out their destinies in life. Through ups and downs, their bond remained strong and never faltered. They went on adventures together, both with such passion for life, and vowed to see everything the world had to offer. What do you got there? Oh, once upon a time. Is this your, the fairy tale story? I hope it is. Here, a royal list circa 2005 when our princesses were still in high school. Brace yourselves. My dream guy has swoopy hair, a nice smile, great sense of humor, always knows how to make me laugh, drives a hot car, has a sensitive side, writes me poetry, as all good high school guys do, right? And most importantly, he has to love cats. <laughs> and so it went on for roughly a hundred more qualities. The bar was set pretty high. nickname for Pete. It's called All or Nothing Pete, which basically means if Pete likes something, Pete gives 150%. He is all about it. He loves it. He's going to do it until he's the best at it. But if Pete doesn't like something, you better watch out. Tara, I got you this gift because when I think of some of my favorite moments and memories with you, I automatically think of our favorite place, Mackinac Island. My favorite memory, of course, is when we rode our bikes around the island screaming, we're engaged. I really love that memory. Now, after today, we will make new memories together for the rest of our lives. I love you, Peter. So example, Pete's like, dude, girls are stupid. Relationships are dumb. Why would you want that? No thanks. So a few months later, um, Pete meets the beautiful and intelligent Tara Taylor, and all of a sudden, relationships are the coolest thing ever. <laughs> so, yeah, all or nothing Pete right there. Tara, you complete me. I can't believe I finally found my second half. I'm so happy that we found each other. You're my best friend. When I'm with you, I'm happier than ever. I love you, and I promise to love you faithfully with all of my heart for the rest of our lives. We get to be a family now, and I can't wait to see what life brings us. I love you. I promise to cherish every day that we have together in our lifetime as husband and wife. From this moment until our last on this earth, I promise to always guard your heart and to love you with all of mine. When she least expected it, and as life often surprises us, Pete was brought into her life at the perfect moment. And now that other young girl in our sweet fairy tale is all grown up, standing in front of her best friend, telling her how happy she is, that her dreams have come true, and that her prince has come. Treasure him as we treasure you, and continue to write your own fairy tale ending together. Yeah.